So this is my last post from Myanmar. Um, behind me is the Shwedagon Pagoda, which is one of the most important, if not the most important, um, for Burmese Buddhists. Um, I didn't go inside because I don't have enough money left. Uh, I have enough for the taxi tomorrow and um, for some food, but it was 8,000 chat, which is like less than five pounds to go in. But it's free for Burmese people, so you know, I think that Buddha would have appreciated squeezing foreigners. Um, Yangon is another very big, very loud, very busy, very hot city, um, which is why I'm only staying here for one day. Uh, I don't really have a kind of feeling on it, but uh, what I will say is that there are some really nice green spaces. So um, there's not a lot of green uh, in the cities that I have been to, parks and stuff like that. So yeah, there's a, a big park that I went to, um, even though something stung me on the leg. Uh, and then this like pond thing, which had like a crazy sort of wooden bridge. Um, so tomorrow I'm getting on an airplane and going to Kuala Lumpur. I have just so enjoyed my time in Myanmar. Um, I had quite high expectations and they have just all been surpassed. It's been so great. The people have been so warm and so kind. Um, just really sort of happy that you are interested in their country and, and want to visit and learn more. I've also met some really great um, other like tourist people who've been traveling as well and, and that has really been wonderful to like meet great people and you know have fun times and um, kind of you know get to learn about not just Burma but you know the places that they come from and, and that kind of stuff so it has really been terrific I am so happy um, and uh, I guess to we'll see what the rest of the trip brings.